Are you using the Zoom platform for your webinars, your conferences and meetings? Well, if you are, that's great. But did you know that you can live stream from Zoom to multiple destinations at the exact same time? Well, I'm gonna show you how to do it in this video. What's going on everybody? Monty Weaver here and welcome to the channel. Here to help you navigate through digital tech and social media, making it easy and simple for you to get through the hurdles of all things technical. So we're gonna jump into the Zoom platform today. But first, we wanna shout out our sponsors of this video, Restream. Restream allows you to stream to over 30 destinations at the exact same time. Their platform is super easy to use, so make sure you check in the description below this video and click on the link to set up your free Restream account today. So we're gonna jump into the computer, do some screen share, and I'm gonna walk you through how you can set up Zoom to broadcast to your favorite destinations at the exact same time. So let's take a look inside the computer and let's get to it. So now we're inside of our Zoom meeting platform. And as you can see at the bottom of our Zoom menu, we have our options to actually live stream under the more tab. So we're gonna click on more and we can see we have the options of Facebook, Workplace by Facebook, YouTube, and our live custom streaming service. But what if we want to go live to Facebook and YouTube at the exact same time? Well, this option is not natively built into Zoom, but we do have a solution thanks to Restream. And so if we want to go to multiple destinations from within our Zoom, we can do that. And we are going to select the live on custom live streaming service. Once we select that, we'll have a pop up window. And this will allow us to put in the credentials for our Restream account. So we're going to open up our Restream account that we've created, and we're gonna select our YouTube and our Facebook as the destinations that we wanna live stream to. But if you wanna select more than these two destinations, you can definitely input as many as you would like. So we're gonna add our Facebook personal profile by selecting the Facebook icon and saving our personal settings. Then we're also going to click on our YouTube channel, select on YouTube and connect, and choose our main YouTube account and allow. And just that easy, you see that we have now created a Facebook and a YouTube account that we can now live stream to. So now we just need to get our RTMP server and stream key information from Restream and put that inside of our Zoom account. So in order to do this, we'll go into the far right section where it says streaming software RTMP and select RTMP settings. And we're going to select our nearest server. There's a drop down arrow that allows you to select locations that may be closer to your physical destination. Mine is already set. So I'm gonna copy this information and go back into that pop-up Zoom window and paste in my server URL. The same thing with our streaming key. We're gonna go back into Restream, copy our key, and paste that information into Zoom. Below this, we have a streaming URL that we can live stream to. This can be your website. So for this example, we'll just select our website address and now we can select go live. Now Zoom is preparing to go live. And here's our website that we could live stream to as well. When we look back at our Restream account, we can see that we are showing live on Facebook and YouTube at the exact same time. So now we don't have to worry about going to just one destination. We can really maximize the power of Zoom connected with Restream to go to multiple destinations at the exact same time. And as you can see here, even during the test, we have a few people watching the live stream. So this allows us to have more viewers just by doing one simple change inside of Zoom. Now, if you got some value from that video, do me a huge favor and click on the thumbs up button. It lets me know that these videos are helping you, helping you navigate through the hurdles that you might encounter when it comes to digital tech and social media. And it lets me know that you are loving the content. 
My name is Monty Weaver. Look forward to seeing you on the next video.